Stop water leaks and improve your home's air quality by repairing your concrete foundation's cracks. The Fast Set Concrete Crack Repair Kit will completely fill the crack and keep water out. This kit allows a do-it-yourselfer to use the same materials a professional uses to fix basement leaks. Including the kit is Hydrostop 300 Expanding Polyurethane Foam. The polyurethane expands in the crack to form a watertight seal. After curing, Hydrostop 300 forms a tight bond to the concrete. All work is done from inside the basement. Do not attempt to repair the, from the exterior side of the foundation. The concrete wall surface must be dry and the crack cannot be actively leaking. However, the interior of the crack can be damp. The temperature should be above 40 degrees Fahrenheit. Open the plastic bag included with the kit and place it on the floor under the crack. If additional floor protection is needed, newspapers can be used. Clean the crack surface with a wire brush. In this example, the crack is partially covered with paint. This paint must be removed and the crack open with a wire brush. Wipe the surface clean with a rag to remove dust. It is not required that you remove the wood studs, although removal may give better results. Start within 4 inches of the bottom of the crack and mark with a pencil or marker every 6 to 12 inches up the crack. This is where the ports will be attached. The tighter the crack, the closer the port should be. Separate the plugs from the injection ports. Do not discard the plugs as they will be used later. Insert the epoxy paste into the caulk gun. Ready the epoxy paste port and crack seal adhesive by unscrewing the cap over the cartridge neck. Extract the plugs from the neck. Dispense approximately 4 ounces of epoxy paste onto a piece of cardboard. Mix the two parts until a uniform gray color with no streaks is obtained. Apply a thin bead of epoxy paste to the bottom of the injection or corner port. Place the injection port over the crack where you previously marked the wall. Check to make sure the injection porthole is open and not covered by epoxy paste. This will prevent the Hydrostop 300 from being injected into the crack. Allow the epoxy paste to cure for 10 to 15 minutes before the next step. After 10 to 15 minutes, mix additional batches of epoxy paste. Build the epoxy paste to 1 8 to 1 quarter inch thick and 3 to 4 inches wide. Be sure to mount additional epoxy paste around the base and onto the neck of the injection port. It is very important to not leave gaps in the epoxy paste that could allow the polyurethane to leak during the injection process. Fill the provided bottle with water. Starting with the topmost port, begin squirting water into it. Water should flow out of the next port down. Inject water into each port, working your way down the wall. Unscrew the cap from the Hydrostop 300 cartridge. Extract the plugs in the neck of the cartridge. Place the quarter inch by 24 element static mixer onto the neck of the cartridge and place the cap over the static mixer. Tighten the cap securely. Load the cartridge into the injection gun. Insert the mixer tightly into the bottom surface injection port and slowly inject. Do not rush. Injecting Hydrostop 300 can take up to 5 minutes per port. The tighter the crack, 
the longer the HydroStop 300 resin will take to flow into the concrete crack. Allow the material to slowly enter the crack. For areas that are difficult to reach, use the flexible hose assembly. Snap the flexible hose assembly into the injection port. Attach the other end to the tip of the static mixer. Begin injecting slowly into the port. Once the HydroStop 300 begins to flow from the next port, release the pressure on the gun, place the mixer into the next higher port, and place a plug into the injection port. Begin to slowly reapply pressure to the injection gun. Repeat until all the ports have been injected. 12 to 24 hours after the injection, the epoxy paste and injection ports can be removed. Remove by chiseling or grinding. Also, the epoxy paste is paintable. You have successfully repaired your concrete crack. The concrete crack is now sealed from water penetrations.